humans of all ages and backgrounds can agree that we feel most alive when sharing and receiving the gift of unconditional love. Unfortunately, the elderly in Georgia are severely neglected by the government and the society alike. Not only are they underappreciated, they often face the harshest economic conditions as a result of limited employment opportunities and lack of social assistance, such as medical aid. Sadly, the situation is only growing more dire. At the moment, one in every five Georgians is over the age of 60. It breaks my heart to know that many of these great people may find themselves alone and isolated, powerless to adapt to a fast-moving world. At the same time, I am privileged to have a loving and attentive family, so I consider it my duty to give back to others who are less fortunate. We often forget that in time we will all get old, so even selfishly, we ought to do our best to improve the lives of those who help the shape the very society we are a part of, especially when all it takes is a bit of time and patience. I know that even a little kindness can go a long way, because I've seen it firsthand while volunteering at an elderly shelter. I've seen 80-year-olds who had just entered the shelter discover and rediscover their love of music, art, poetry, and life in general after only a few interactions with the group and the volunteers. These experiences have taught me the importance of listening and caring, and that it is never too late to start living your life to the fullest. I want to share this message with the world and inspire others to spread the love. It's worth remembering that you can make a difference. You have the power to brighten a day, lighten a mood, and put a smile on the face of a complete stranger.